addition to creating one-time activities, you can also create activities that occur on a repeating schedule in ACT. Let's say that you want to create a weekly status update meeting that takes place every Tuesday morning at 10 a.m. for you and two of your coworkers who use ACT. Here's how to do that. First, I'll go to my lookup menu and I'm gonna choose all contacts. Then, once all my contacts are displayed, I'm gonna sort this list by ACT users. If you click that twice, the ACT users will appear at the top of the screen. Now, while holding down the control button on my keyboard, I can choose the two users who need to be in this meeting with me. And then to schedule the meeting, I'll just click the meeting button at the top. Notice that my two coworkers already appear in the schedule with field. So all I need to do is set the date and time for the first meeting. I'll set it for Tuesday at 9 a.m. In the regarding field, I need to type something like weekly status update. And now the next step is I want to make this a recurring meeting. So at the top, I'm going to click the recurrence tab and then I'm going to set it to occur on a weekly schedule and I'll make sure that Tuesday is the only box checked. At the bottom we can set an end date for this recurring meeting. So I'm going to say I only want this to occur from now through the end of the year. So I'll click December 31st. That's all there is to it so now I'll click OK at the bottom of the window and that meeting has now been scheduled. Now if I go to my task list I can scroll down and see that the meeting has been scheduled and I know it's recurring because of the recurrence icon on each of these meetings. The task list won't list every occurrence here but only the next one on the calendar. If I clear this activity then the next occurrence will appear on this screen. If I go to my calendar I can see that this meeting is now scheduled for me and each of the coworkers that I included. If I click on the meeting then I can edit this activity. Maybe this week's meeting has been changed from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. In that case, I'll change the time. And when I click OK, ACT is going to ask me if I want to edit just this occurrence or all occurrences. I'll just leave it to this single occurrence and click OK again. So in ACT CRM, it's simple to create activities that occur more than once on a regular schedule. When creating activities like this, use the Recurrence tab. 